Hello and we're back in Call of Cthulhu, Dark Corners of the Earth, the sewers. So how, how's our arm doing? Oh, it now only needs bandages. Now, the problem is, uh, it can be the other way around. If you Wait overuse everything. the bandages, then you've got no fallback. Yeah. Which means you just can't heal anything anymore. Now, you know, scratches aren't fatal, but they can slow you down, they can make you more susceptible to uh, sanity loss, that sort of thing. Yeah. I think maybe trying Actually, to... I really like the reflections, but they don't quite work right. No, they're not right, quite to the right scale, because they're, they're more mirrored than sort of reflections would really work like. Actually, it's more the waves which I don't think are working quite well. But uh, yeah, I think maybe keeping the amount of sutures and bandages we have at the same level, possibly. gonna go into a corner and give her. <laughs> like yes, I think this is the beginning of us being uh, haunted by the spirit either real or imagined of Ramona Waits. Oh dear. Cool sewers, though. Ooh. Yeah, it's really lovely. Apart from that. Yeah, it's really lovely. He says. <laughs> yeah. Is that? Ah, shit. ah, it's corrosive. I should never come here. No, you shouldn't have, dude. What the hell? So there's gunk everywhere. Did that actually? Wow. Yeah. Oh dear. So I take it once wounds have gotten to the point of bandages, they can never fully heal on their own. There's something down here. That is a good question. I don't think they do. And yes, there's, there is something in the water. What the hell is all this stuff? Again, uh, um, amnesia reminder. Oh. Because it's another game that has sort of gunk stopping your way, doesn't it? Mm hmm. But yes, it's worrying blood trail. Oh, I think even the, the banisters are covered in it. Yeah, we want to be a bit more careful. <laughs> We're going to follow this blood trail, though. Oh, God. Oh god, a bit interesting, because we keep finding dead bodies trying to reach elder signs. His body is covered in this slimy muck. It's like, do they also know it's protecting them? Well, presumably that's why they're drawing it. Yeah. I'm just going to take the opportunity to save. Death that's is an ever-present threat. Yeah. I'd Ugh. suggest up if we can, rather than down, yeah. I don't want to deal with any of that. I wish more locks. I wish more locks had bolts. No. I wish more doors, doors had, had bolts. Locks. Or locks. Health really? kit, that's good. We need that. 
Oh, you know, have seven bandages again. A couple more bandages, yeah. yeah. Yes, because the problem is, you're not sure if... Should you feel safe? No. Is no. this abandoned enough? Oh, wow. Mysterious gunk. Keeps doing that though. The tank's full of slimy water. There's no way I'm getting in. How is it sort of dripping from the pipes? Right. So it's one of those pipes got slime in it then. It's sort of corrupting the rest of it by accident. Obviously I know what to do, but uh Yeah, we're playing cool. along. So what we do is there's pipes here. Yeah. I can't remember which one's on and which one's off, but we can change them. And we can hear water going in, I think. So then we can use this, which I believe opens the sluice gate. Oh, this feels very Silent Hill puzzly as well, doesn't it? So yes, you see the sluice gate going up and down? Yeah. The water looks reasonably clean. I just need to drain it away. Okay. Yep, so we can go in, we just need to drain it. So obviously we turned one off and one on. So I think it was probably that way around. Maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> so does that mean we need to do one sluice or the other one? So do that. That'll clean the water out, I think. Does it in is it instant or do I need to flush it away? No, you need to sluice each time. That's fair. You should be able to just do that and then go back again to the double pipe. Well, I want to make sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and instead of the right one, the left one, yeah? yeah. There we go. Sounds quiet. Then we have to go quickly. Oh! How? So, did I just do that too slow? I think you were a little slow. Thanks. Oh, <laughs> is there some other mechanism? I like how that actually hurt your face. Yeah, it's cool like that, isn't it? Because you would have actually hurt your face. So your head, you know. It's area-based enough for it to be impressive. <sighs> yeah, life hack. <laughs> yes, I suppose if you're struggling with that. No, there's something else I've got to do then. That just hit me again. Hmm. So what have I missed? If you try that door, oh, I'm sure it's actually through here. We've got any items, or is it just that I'm not being quick enough? I mean, is, is it literally just that? Taco. It won't open. It must be. That's back the way we came. An old metal cabinet. It's empty. Should have examined that before, but never mind. Yes, I like the, the version where you're sort of sitting on the rim. So to speak. Ducked already, so I can... Do you have to hold it? Do you just not tap it? Oh, is that what I'm doing wrong? Yeah, I, I wasn't under the impression that you had to hold it to get it to do what it was doing. There you go, yes, you just have to click it, you don't have to click hold. Life hack. 
Hashtag. <lacht> Wie heißt That doesn't look like a fun time. No. Fun time not had by all. By the way, that was Zadok Allen. Oh, I didn't realize. So the game has this wonderful thing where it keeps on adding things we should be guilty about. And it layers, and this is why we go mad. Someone else who is only killed by the Order because they're associated with us. Yes, this rather just looks like the place where they dump the dead people. Before we explore further and try and get the hell out of here, we're going to leave it there. Bye-bye.